Hello and welcome back to our Let's Play, sp Let's Play Space Camp. We're on part 26. And now we're going to look at another defense mission, which I do not like these ones, but we'll see what we can do from that. Oh, we got a story. Okay. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, wow. The Kraken! Okay. So... Wow, okay, um... Again, we have no recycler. Everything needs to be a minimum of... Minimum of 2, minimum of 25, minimum of 25 for this. So plutonium... But that's way down there in the chart, isn't it? Yeah, it is in the near bottom area. It's 94. We need two of these. We need to go from oxygen to that. Alrighty. And we also need to make sure that the oxygen is double bonded and then the hydrogens are single bonded. Okay. And we need to fire a missile. So this brings up an interesting point. Can we do it? Well, let's do some math. Our wonderful thing about math. Can you see that? You can't see that. I'll make the font a little bigger. If you'll let me. Spinning wheel of death. Okay. We're given one oxygen and two hydrogen, which is 10 atoms or electrons. We need to make H2, O2, and Pu. We need to make two of those, 25 of those, and 25 of those. This is 50. This is 25 times 8, so that would be, that would be 0, then the f so 200. And then we need to make 96, 69, 96 times 2, or was it 94? Okay, 94 times 2. That is 108. So in total, we're looking at 250 plus 108. That is 4, 3, 8. So I'm looking at about 44 cycles of intakes before I can actually do the fire. I have some good news though. We have a magical controls again. I think we only get those on defense missions. So we're going to take our fusion altar, our reactor. And we're going to take a sensor that's going to break it up. We're going to do our merger. Okay.
second question I should be asking. Oh wait, you guys have seen this still. Okay, it's still good. 94 divided by 8. That is a 1 with a 10, which leaves me with 14 divided by 8, which is 11 and 6. So I need 11 oxygen and 6 hydrogen in order to make this. Or I can go 14 hydrogen and 10 oxygen. And it'll be easier to actually do it this way because for every whole water set I'll get one hydrogen, uh, two hydrogen out of that. By the time I hit 7 I'll have my 14 hydrogen. And then I can make the um, I can make these in with the other some the other three compounds as the other oxygens go up here. So we're gonna get rid of this. Do our divider. In fact I might actually change the name for this eventually. So right now Actually, let's go back to our water level here. Grab this one, save the toolbox. Ah, water bra. I was gonna go water breaker. Okay, so we got our hydrogen up here, and we got our oxygen down there. That saves us some time, and we don't have to waste a video on that, but then again, I already kind of did with uh, my explanations of science of how I'm going to do this. Now I need to break it up. Or divide it out, at least. So both will be going... Both will be going into this. I'll give them two just to be nice and considerate. Okay, so this is going to the fusion hall, and this will be going to the. Okay. So oxygen wants to go on the top here. So I want oxygen to go here, and I want hydrogen to go here. Because then I can go and do this. Or on the bottom of it? and then hydrogen. Okay, I'm gonna try something that does that. We'll pretend we're blue. Blue's going to input, blue's going to grab. Don't know which one it's going to be, it's going to come up here. Check. Actually, I don't need to worry, it is going to be this right way if I do it this way. Bond, bond. Hydrogen is going to be the easiest 
if it doesn't um, bond, it's going to drop. If it does bond, it's done. So this is the idea. It's going to input. We don't know if it's going to be oxygen or hydrogen. Let's say it was oxygen. Oxygen is going to go here. It's going to grab it. Nothing's here to grab. It detects it's oxygen. It's going to go up. It's going to try bonding. There's nothing there to bond with. It's going to come around and try bonding again. There's still nothing there to bond. It'll drop it here and go. Now put nothing from here. It inputs again. Let's say it's another oxygen. It grabs it. It's going to go up. Bond it. We got our first bond. It's going to come around. And then when it hits here, it should bond again twice. Unfortunately, it will drop again. <sighs> How did I do this last time? Because I did, I did the same thought process in this challenge. Didn't I? It was in the... Uh, yeah, this one. Oh, it's a grab drop. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so this would just be a grab drop then. holding will drop it. Okay. How can we make this work then if we're doing a grab drop? Well in this case it'll be easy. I'll just come over here grab it again, if there's something there. Doesn't matter where I do that. Do that. So in the hydrogen case, it'll come down, grab the hydrogen, go over here, go down, bond, there's still nothing there, drop it. Grab. Drops nothing, goes over, tries again, gets another hydrogen, bonds it, it now has it, it will just, just has to be a drop. We'll drop it here, go over, grab it again, come over, drop it again, and so on and so forth. So in this case, this needs to be a drop and grab here. Because we'll just push it over, I think. Now, sake of example, I'm going to input on the B and have B solely do this. Why am I going to be doing it this way? It actually doesn't matter in this case if I do it like this or like that. So I'm just going to swap these two around just so I know where I'm putting things. Because I find the symbols are better. Drop and then output. Red's gonna come. Grab that, go down there.
and then output. And our first reactor is fine. So we see that this is working. So this is all working nice and dandy. Now the whole plan is oops. The whole plan is that in here If I hit A, it's going to start fueling up this section. In fact, I don't want to do the A there, I want to do it there. So I just need to know that it's oxygen down there, right there, and then hydrogen right there. Right? Yeah, this is oxygen. Now I have my fusion reactor. Now remember what I said, if I do seven oxygens, and I will have to watch, Seven oxygens, I only need 14 hydrogens. Or if I get 11 oxygens, I need 6 hydrogens. Now, I could and I will do this. This one's going to be our emergency, oops, oopsie, I did it wrong. And I'm going to tell Blue, in case B, go this way. Actually, no, I don't want there. In case B, In the case B, where I made a mistake, go over here, yeah, I'll just skip it all, input on A, grab, grab or okay so we're just gonna work with this first S in control C go over here and then up and then drop okay Okay, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to think how I'm going to do this. Cause it's gonna imp he's going to grab this. So I'm going to grab this. Change 
change this. I can change this, I think. Yeah, I can change this. It's like, no, my one. Um, we're at our 20 minute mark. We shall continue this idea in the next part.